morning guys. It's about quarter after five. Um, Oliver here is full of just whew, pizzazz and vinegar. Um, I didn't sleep real good last night. So I, I, I woke up at like 1230 and I was up until 2.30, quarter to three and I slept until like five o'clock. Um, my back hurts really bad for some reason. Didn't lift anything, didn't move funny to my knowledge, but boy, my back hurts so bad this morning. I real I couldn't even lay in bed. When I woke up at 12.30 this morning, I went out and laid on the floor and then I couldn't get up. Um, it hurt bad. I don't ever take like ibuprofen or, you know, Advil, any of that stuff. And because I used to have to take it so often because I suffered from migraines really badly. We figured out what it was. Those haven't bothered me regularly for a very long time. So I try not to take anything if I can help it. Uh, this morning I had to. Um, like I said, I don't know what it was, but coffee's making it go down a little easier. I didn't do black coffee this morning. I needed something a little bit. I don't know, creamier this morning. So I put one tablespoon of fat-free half and half in my coffee for zero points and one tablespoon of sugar in my coffee for three points. So my coffee this morning is three points and I don't know what I'm having for breakfast yet, but you will see a picture. Okay, everybody, it is quarter to nine. And Oliver and I are headed to the transfer station. Oh, my back is still not doing good. It's not, well, it's not as bad as it was. I took some ibuprofen early this morning and I um, put some uh, Bengay type, like a generic Bengay on. And it feels a lot better than it did this morning because, whew, baby, it was bad. But we'll see how it goes. I really need to get a new window mount. This, is, this one's just driving me nuts. I can see it shaking. I'm really sorry about that. I've tried to get it to stick on my side window and it bends, but only to like a certain degree and my, the clamp that, that is on it that holds my phone doesn't always bend to a, to the, you know, the proper angle. So you either get a view of my steering wheel or the side of my window or anything. It even actually, if I were to switch the camera view, would actually show you the clamp that sucks it to the window and the edge of the clamp that holds my phone. It's just... I've got to find another way to do it in the truck. Maybe won't be such an issue in my car, but I drive my truck and my motorcycle when the weather's nice as much as I can. It's just hard to drive my motorcycle to go to the transfer station or to go to town if I need to get something. So, I don't know. Um, It's a beautiful weather today. Beautiful riding, it's not cold at all. That's as far as I can go for the west shore. That island right there, I don't know if you can see it directly, actually that big part of the broken off branch is pointing to it. That island, there's nothing, no trees are living on it. There's no anything living on it. There is a house built on it, but it's all covered in cormorant poop and it has killed everything on that island. Now they've gone through years ago and put oil over all of the eggs to try to reduce the population. We have a lot around here and nobody likes them and they're killing the island. They're making it difficult for native birds to get the food that they need. So they've tried to, they're trying to take measures to control their population. But this today is just so clear and so sunny. That's New York. All over there that you can see on the other side of the lake is all New York. All right, back on the bike. Oh, hi guys. So I just got back 
from my motorcycle ride <laughs> and the puppies were missing me. Uh, normally we take them, but we're having a problem with Oliver's harness and Oliver would be the one that I would take on my bike because he's lighter and he doesn't wiggle around as much. Anyway, um, so I hope you enjoyed the view of our west side of the island. I got pretty pelted with bugs, so I hope I don't have any bug debris on me. I know, sounds sick, but you know, I don't have a windshield on my bike. I prefer it that way, but I've often felt the odd um, bug carcass stuck to my skin. Nothing like eating bugs in the summer. Anyway, totally. Anyway, butterfly. So I hope you really enjoyed the view of the west side of our island, at least what I could show to you or show you of it. Um, it is about three o'clock. I haven't had any lunch. I'm just feeling kind of snacky. Um, so instead of the lunch I had planned, I'm going to have a Shupao, which is a Filipino steamed bun. Um, the only ones, <laughs> uh, usually my friend makes them for me, but I was really wanting something um, to keep at home for when I wanted one and she wasn't available to make them. I pay her to make them. She doesn't, I don't, you know, she makes me a bunch of them at a time. But um, I wanted something I could kind of keep them ho keep at home, and I found some at Trader Joe's. They're not called, well, she calls them Shupao, and these are called, I can't remember, something very similar. Sha Bao, maybe, is what they're called. I can't remember. I'm trying to picture the package in my head, and I can't, I can't quite remember the spelling. But anyway... Um, so these are really good. Now I have to do have to take my medicine to eat them, but I've re I really wanted some today and one, I took my medicine. So one isn't going to be too bad. Um, sorry, the dogs are playing down here and they're just like, ugh. I don't know if you can hear all this like little crinkling and crunching and knocking around. It's a toy that we got them and I'm always thinking they're getting into something. Anyway, whoo, focus. So, Shupao, the Trader Joe ones are five points a piece, and they're chewy, and they're sweet. It's a sweet pork and oniony filling. Um, so, one is really all I need. I'm not hungry. I'm just kind of snacky. Um, so, I'm just going to have one of these for five points. I've got my sparkling water over on my desk, and I think I'm just going to wait after that for dinner. So... I will, I am having trouble also, um, editing yesterday's video. My, for some reason, after a video hits a certain length, my software crashes and I'm not sure why I'm still trying to figure that out. But if you don't see yesterday's video, I'm, I'll probably, I'll start over and try to repost it, but it's not going well at the moment. I've been trying to do this for two days. So I'm going to try to work with that some more, get this this one uploaded and edited up to this point, and then figure out what we're doing for dinner. 